Hey guys, I'm starting this vlog very late today because things just got in the way of stuff this morning. So last night we went to bed really late, really late. So this morning when Milton woke me up at 8 a.m. for her usual feeding at 8 a.m., I just fed them like a zombie and then I went back to bed. And then I woke up at 10 and then had to rush to like get them to potty and everything. And then I did an IG live workout. And then, and then now it's 1 p.m. and here we are. I did catch up on my emails though. Did catch up on the DMs and everything is okay. So now I'm having the first meal of the day. This is my version of like a vegetarian pad thai. Very good. Oh, it's cold. So when, uh, right now my food is reheating. So I'm just gonna update you on what we're gonna do today. I think it's a long weekend in the States, Memorial Day or something, but um, we don't have a long weekend. I'm working today, Angie has some stuff to pick up at Walmart. Did you, ha do you guys have that in the States too? It's Walmart pickup, so they, you order online and then when the order is ready, you just go curbside, pick up the order, they put in your car. And then I'm supposed to get some packages delivered today, which is very exciting. I ordered some stuff for the house and some stuff for myself. So if I get that today, I will do an unboxing with you all. So, and then, yeah, it's almost Hurricane Milton's lunchtime. So that's going to be always a good time, huh? Everybody loves to see what you eat, Herky. Good girl. What do you want to eat today? How about we feed you on the licky mat today? Can I show your friends your shirt? Oh. You Everybody guys, love your shirt in the last video. You guys don't know what I'm really excited about? I just discovered that on Amazon Prime, you can buy Hawaiian shirts for like $19 and they ship it to you. This is one, this one's not from Amazon Prime, this one's from LA. But I'm so excited to receive all the stuff from Amazon Prime. Oh, it's like, very exciting. This week. Yeah, if we get it, we're going to show it on a vlog for sure. Did you get anything? Um, I got some stuff, but not from Amazon Prime. Mm. I, I was just telling them I might have packages to unbox, so it's gonna be fun. So yeah, like, it's so boring to be just stuck at home and in quarantine. So we decided that we're gonna spark our lives up with some Hawaiian shirts and colors and we're gonna just really funk you this summer. Bring on the funk. Gotta have on that funk. funk. Bring, Bring on, on the funk. funk. Gotta have that funk. Okay, I'm gonna go pick up my little cousin now. Okay. She's a... Uh, She's a, a content creator as well, and she's only 22 years old. And for some reason, she needs to be in Montreal right now. So I'm going to pick her up, and we'll introduce you guys maybe later. So can you tell us what's your actual link with her, like your family link, and who her mom is? So her mom is Christy Chung. I'm Andy Chung. Christy is a big uh, actress in in China, and Yasmin is her daughter. So her daughter is like 22. So Christy used to babysit me when I was a kid. And when I went to live in China, Christy was taking care of me a lot. And now Yasmin is here living at Christy's parents' house, which are her grandparents. And she lives like around two minutes from here. And she's new to Montreal. Um, circumstances has it that she has to be in Montreal right now. And we're gonna show her around and we're gonna, she loves to create content and she wants a dog too. So it's perfect for like, Hey, we have her here, Milton here. She knows her name. No. Milton. And we also have a studio for her to use in case she wants to take pictures and create content. So maybe you'll see more of Yasmin in the next few vlogs. See you later. See you later. So here is Herky and Milton's lunch. This is the Country Raw's turkey dinner and it's still a bit frozen. So it's gonna be a lovely lunch for them. I spread it on the licky mat. When you use these, don't forget to clean them well after because there's raw meat on it. Yeah, let's go feed it to them. Herky? Turkey loves to wipe her mouth on me after she has a meal. I don't know if this is her way of her saying thank you 
or she's just wanting to put her meat sauce on me. I don't know. Huh, Herky? You putting your meat sauce on mommy? Are you saying thank you? Oh, honey. Good girl. Good girl. Oh. Hi. Oh, you're sweet today. Why are you so cuddly today? So, there's a boiling water advisory in the city of Brossard right now where we live. Which means that before you drink any water, you have to boil it. So, you constantly have to put some water on the stove, boil it, and then put it in the filter brider. Fil filter brider? Brita filter. And then cool it. But don't you guys think that boiled water always tastes like boiled water? I think it tastes weird. Time for Herkin Milton's hip and joint chew. Um, so we use Ferapet Organics hip and joint chew. This one has glucosamine, MSM, chondroitin, organic turmeric, green lip muscle, yucca root, and fish oil. These are developed by our friend Michelle Dulek in LA, event extraordinaire. And um, a lot of joint chews on the market are available. We just choose to go with these ones. The girls love the taste. And if you didn't know, Herc and Milton have these because they have a luxating patella, asymptomatic luxating patellas. So uh, we just try to keep them healthy, go on frequent walks, long walks, sustained exercise, and support their joints with some chews. And some people were asking for a progress regarding their luxating patella and where our thought process is regarding the surgery. We're still at the same spot. They don't have any pain. They don't limp. They don't hop. They don't have any symptoms with the luxating patella. So we decided to keep going as it is um, until they start developing symptoms, until they start showing signs of pain or anything, and when it becomes actually necessary. Okay, time for a little unboxing. I just received two packages, as I mentioned earlier. And this first one is from La Maison Lavande, which is that lavender field that we visited last summer. So this is some stuff for home. Milton thinks it's for her. Nice little pamphlet. Handwritten thank you cards are always nice. I love it. Ooh. What's all this, Milton? Oh no, it leaked. Well, it was open, so wait, I'm gonna... Okay, so from, aside from the leakage, we I ordered a backup of their shampoo for dogs. I love how this smells. It's vanilla and lavender, and I used a lot of the other one already, so a backup was in order, although it leaked everywhere in the box, so I'm gonna email them to see if they can do something about it. And then we have a big format like this of hand sanitizer. I love this size of bottle because we can refill our little ones that we have. And this one smells like lavender and it's really gentle on the hands. It has like 70% alcohol, which falls in the recommended um, alcohol content for hand sanitizer, but it's not like 90% alcohol where it just dehydrates your hands. So love that. And we have some hand soap. This is a pure lavender hand soap since everybody's washing their hands so much right now. And I also got the peony and lavender. Ooh, look, Milton, you want to smell? Mmm, smells good. Yes. And then I got a small format of the fabric spray. And this is peony and lavender as well. This is great if you want to spray like your 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 bed sheets, your pillows and everything before going to bed is great. Then I got two hand creams, one pure lavender and one um, hazelnut and lavender. These smells great. Okay, this package is from Simon's. It's a local store in Montreal, in Quebec actually. And I just got a bunch of little pajamas and stuff to wear around the house cozily because we're all just staying at home and wearing cozy clothes. Oh, this is a bit small. Hey guys. I just want to introduce you guys to my little cousin, Yasmin. Hi! And she's going to be hanging out with Herkia Milton 
and taking some pictures for us and doing some content creation. You're a content creator too, right? Yeah, I am. What's your page? Um, it's Yasmin Ross and then underscore. Or on YouTube, you can just type in Yasmin Ross. So, yeah. so now you might have some Herky at Milton friend checking out your page. <laughs> yeah. She's a really good content creator and she does some really cool stuff like uh, some lifestyle vlogs and stuff. So go check her out. So we just played in the field a bit, and we're very um, turned off by a lot of things. Oh, Turkey yeah. tried to eat a carcass of something that had fur on it. Ugh. Looked like dead squirrel jerky. And then mine got bitten by a bunch of mosquitoes, and now we're going back and forth. Like, I don't know if you guys already know this. Probably not, because it's so irrelevant. But I'm, I think I'm allergic to mosquito bites because they swell so much when I get a mosquito bite. Oh, here's my poop bag. They swell so much when I get a mosquito bite. And now that it's really humid today, there's a heat wave coming, mosquitoes are out. And I think I just got bitten on the neck here. Yay. So now I want to go back inside. Milton's happy with her chuck it. She's very happy with her chuck it. At least she got to run a bit. Yep, she seems very tired. Oh, a mean cat. A mean crazy one? Oh no, no, he, he's nice. Oh, oh nice. yep. Oh, let's go see the kitten. Do you want to take the chuck it or Milton? Chuck it. Oh shit. <laughs> Yay. Go Milton. Go. Oh, he's gone. Oh, okay. You guys are looking at the cinnamon. Ooh. How do you like the cinnamon toast crunch? It's really good. Yeah? Yeah. How would you rate it? Honestly, you don't have to be nice to me. Um, maybe 7 out of 10. Oh, nice. Like, it has cinnamon toast crunch vibes. Yeah. But it's not like cinnamon toast crunch. Yeah, it's you know? like more soft. I, yeah. You get the flavors. For yeah. Sure. It's not for you, girls. No, no, no. It's not for you. I like, can't stop eating it. <laughs> All right. Preparing some broccoli and some pizza tonight. Ooh. This was supposed to look a bit nicer, but it was cut a bit prematurely. Is it crispy? It looks delightful. Look at the crust. Zoom in the crust. Ooh. And show your basil tree. Oh yeah, this... I decided to buy a little plant of basil instead of buying the little containers all the time. But I don't think this grows. I do put water in this every day to give it water, but I don't think it'll grow. So. Once we'll be done with the leaves, it'll be done. So this one just has our usual mozzarella, parm, and basil. And the other one has sausage. There's one coming up also. Andy did the dressing on this one. I am I'm matching the pizza. You are? Okay, Yasmin, you can take a piece. 
and I'm going to get your first impression on our pizza. This is how we have pizza at home now. <laughs> you have to be honest. There's a lot. Oh, ones. nice. She took the one with the bubbles. <laughs> I love the bubbles too. Hmm. <laughs> you like it? Yeah, it's actually really good. Thank you. Mm hmm. <laughs> I think that was sincere. <laughs> I like like the flavors and everything. It's mm -hmm. like not right. not too doughy, but mm -hmm. not too crunchy either. Yep, it's really good. Nice. Mm -hmm. The fresh basil is like love basil, the right? Mm -hmm. It makes it just taste more healthy. Yeah, you can you can try this one too to can see you? how it compares to the other ones. You uh, you get your I want your impression. You're rating yourself, baby. So don't go too hard. It's really good. Like I like that it holds because it was cooked in the cast iron, mm -hmm. so it's like crisp on the bottom. Mm -hmm. The simplicity of it is... It's something we learned in New York. It's the yeah. simplicity of pizza. Yeah. It's just about cheese, <laughs> tomato mm -hmm. sauce, and the mm -hmm. basil. Like everything homemade. Mm -hmm. The dough, the sauce, everything. Oh. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look at that enthusiasm. Enthusiast. I've shown the this exact pizza on this vlog like 10 times. <laughs> Okay. Mm. You hear that? Mmm. Mm. It's so oily and buttery. It's been cooking in oil in the cast iron, that's why. The cast iron is also the secret. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of secrets being revealed. Mmm. Very good. Like? I like. Don't forget the broccoli. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody wants to eat broccoli now, huh? <laughs> None of you. <laughs> After the first piece. Okay, here's the sausage one. Make it was snow. the sausage from Piet Cochon. But I'm repurposing for pizza. That's a lot of sausage, baby. I know. I just wanted to get rid of it. I wanted to throw out the Tupperware. We don't know what sausage it is. Like, is it, was it pork? Was it I think duck? it's pork. It looks very unhealthy. Yeah. But very good. This looks like you have your own cooking show. It's fun, huh? I feel like a chef. And speaking of, I think I have to have Hurricane Milton's food too. Ooh, it looks cute. It's cute. The green helps. Right? It looks cuter now than when it came out of the oven, let's just say. And we also have a plate of this. <laughs> Okay, tonight for Herc and Milton's dinner, they're just having the turkey dinner formula from Big Country Raw, which is a complete formula, which means I don't have to add anything to it. It has its perks. So I'm just gonna scoop out a What's bit. What's the turkey dinner? It has turkey meat, organs, and bone, and carrots, uh, and fruits, and vegetables, and um, fish oil, so... That's what kind a complete of, meal. What kind of vegetables and fruits do they put in there? I don't know. I have to check the formula. Interesting. Okay, girl. Snoods. Come here. Come here. Full formula, girls. Okay, tonight for Herc and Milton's dinner, they're just having the turkey dinner formula from Big Country Raw, which is a complete formula, which means I don't have to add anything to it. It has its perks. So I'm just gonna scoop out a What's bit. What's the turkey dinner? It has turkey meat, organs, and bone, and carrots, uh, and fruits, and vegetables, and um, fish oil, so. What That's kind a complete of, meal. What kind of vegetables and fruits do you put in there? I don't know. I have to check the formula. Interesting. Okay, girl. Snoods.
How exciting, girls. Full formula, girls. Here. Milton, what are you looking for? Milton asked to go in this thing every night to she's sniff in. her toys. Oh, she's in. 100%. Milton. Milton. Yoo-hoo. Oh, hey your hair. <laughs> you guys like how long my hair is? I haven't cut my hair since December. Plus, I was telling my that I needed my hair to be thicker, like how it used to be when I was like in my 20s. And then she told me to drink these vitamins of hers. You know, our friend Tati, that I want to meet, but I've never met. She makes this brand called Halo Beauty. I don't know what it is, this, okay? It's like super expensive. And Maya just told me to pay for it. So I listened to everything my wife says. I got these vitamins <laughs> and she's laughing her ass off. So I've been taking these vitamins since like January. No, Feb. Yeah, it's February? been like two months. Yeah, since February. Since February. Two capsules of this per day. It smells really bad. I know there's a lot of vitamin B in it. I don't know what else it is. But it's supposed to like promote hair growth. And holy crap. Like you have so can you turn around? Like it's really voluminous now. Like, it's not like you had bad hair before or anything, but I feel like it just grew much faster now. And I, also, like, your facial hair and My nails, nails grow right? really fast. I feel like I could be casted in The Last Samurai right now as one of the, the, the samurais, and, like, I would fit the role. Okay, go. Audition. I have no pants on, by the way. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm boxers. I just took a shower. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> Insert that guy the last time. <laughs> totally, I feel like I'm some sort of Asian warrior from the ancient times. And I love it. Tati Westbrook, Halo Beauty Booster. I recommend. Andy Chung approved. It's really good. Good job. <laughs> and the girls are pooped. We just went on a little drive this afternoon because it's one of my good friend's birthday. So we drove by her house for me to drop off some ice cream that I made for her. And then we drove Yasmin around downtown for her to see what it's like. Although it does, it's not a very accurate representation because it's such a ghost city, ghost town. But at least we were able to drive through the city to show her. And then we drove her home and now here we are. Another day done. Another day done. What do you guys think of Yasmin? She's sweet, huh? Yes, was a sweetheart. She's so sweet. Sweet little girl. She's only 22. 22 year old girls are so much more than 22 year old boys. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Milton. Milton. Hi. What you doing, baby? What you doing? You're looking at me backwards? Did daddy put on your pajama, honey? What are you doing? How are you doing? Milton. Milton. You cutie pie. You cutie pie. Hi, Herky. You're cute too, honey. You're the cutest. Can you say goodnight to your friends? Herky, say goodnight. Oh, she wants to wag. <laughs>